I'm Isaac Drandich, I'm the director of City of Gold. My name is Simone Tesorieri. Uh, I'm the set designer for uh, City of Gold. And I am Simona Cosentini, second set designer for City of Gold. Yeah. The work's really based on a lot of Main Wyatt, the playwright, and the central character performer in this work. It's um, based on his uh, life experience of losing a father and working in the industry and what it means for an Aboriginal person to work in the theatre industry and entertainment industry in Australia. The mood and the atmospheres are not balanced in a certain way. There is always something happening, there is always a little bit of a distortion, there is always that um, injustice happening that we wish we could kind of get rid of, but it's there, we have to face every day. Um, and so I like the politics behind it. There's a lot in this work, there's a lot of themes and there's a lot of ideas in this work and somehow, somehow it kind of expresses itself in this really kind of magical way and having Maine kind of really connected to the story and to the content of, in this work and as the performer in this work you can feel a really strong synergy between the content and the performer in this particular work which is really it, it's it's a really interesting kind of feeling that you come away with the main um, environment we are in is definitely the city of Kalgoorlie this bare land it's dusty as hell uh, dry <laughs> almost in hospital um, but it's the place where Braith and the family belong to is where they are empowered where they are themselves and mum's house as well so it we, we, we were kind of, along the process, we moved from something that was a psychological space where everything had been kind of worked uh, around metaphors of the spaces themselves. And so very stylized or very much abstract. And we have moved into something that it's more realistic. Not because it's easier. Uh, we don't consider that realism sometimes easier, but it's something that the audience will kind of feel like, oh, this is familiar. I can accept this to then focus on what's the real story about. I think a lot of directors are naturally drawn towards work where the story kind of needs to be told. It's almost kind of shouting at us and saying, tell me please. And this is one of those works. They are great cast, a really great cast yeah. and great people. And yeah, they support us and we try to support them in a better way. And at the end of the father, at the end of the season, well, we are like a family in some ways. So it it's, is. It's beautiful. That's probably the best part. Mm -hmm.